boy. Now in this video, I'm going to show you how to boost your PC performance to gain a lot of FPS to play HNG. So, first thing you want to do is go to the start menu on the left bottom corner and you want to right click and go to the system. And it will show your PC the specification I have a uh, i3 processors and I have 12 gigabytes RAM and you want to scroll down and find advanced system settings click on that and on the performance section you want to go to settings and adjust your visual effect to best performance but you want to check this smooth edge of screen font so it doesn't look shit then you click on this and on the virtual memory you want to change it to custom size and you want to manage however you want for your virtual memory it will boost your PC performance a lot more so I have 20 gigs and you can add 5 gigs, 4 gigs or 8 gigs whatever you want on your local disk free space it will use your free space as a virtual memory and it will boost your PC performance a lot so you already add custom size click OK and here we go apply OK and close it now you want to press Windows plus R and this will pop up you want to go to the MS config click OK and go to the booting settings now if you have an SSD driver you want to check this so it will make your booting a lot faster but if you don't have SSD so you don't need to check this so just leave it like that and you want to go to the advanced options and choose your how many processor threads do you have I have so I have four threads choose four and if you have 16 core core threads you choose 16 or you have eight you choose eight whatever how many processor thread do you have so I have four click OK and apply OK and it will ask you to restart your computer so you want to restart your computer first and then after you restart your computer first if you have any spare USB you can use it as a ready boost it's also same as the virtual memory it will, it will boost your PC performance too use as many free space of your USB have so I have 7 gigs click apply and use this dev space and it will boost your PC too by a lot and after that you want to go to the NVIDIA control panel
and you want to go to the program settings for specific application and we will choose heroes and generals so you want all of these settings to set to off everything's off and virtual ready pre-rendered frames on set to 4 click apply and ok now I want to go to the steam you want to go to the settings and go to the in-game settings and you want to uncheck this box right here enable this overlay while in game so you don't want to have this it will reduce your PC performance on while running your game so you want to have this not checked and click OK go to the game now so I have like so much of a difference but yeah, 40, 50, barely touch 60 so let's go to the advanced thing of my game settings of video so I have shadow quality low, all quality low, all low and all off and what's gonna boost your FPS more to is your interface also on the interface you want to turn off your action outlines turn that off and you want to turn the compass off since I'm not using any of it and I'm not used to compass in this game so I turn it off and also icon icon fade yeah, I'm setting it to off it actually helped me to gain more FPS with this off and it's also annoying when you meet enemy it blocks the enemy so you don't see them so I turn it off and yeah immersive food so, so you don't don't want this you want to have all of this to show Oh, and also I forgot to mention that your resolution is also helping a lot to what makes your game have more FPS so you can set it to very low but somehow I set it very low I still get less more FPS than what I have resolution now so it's, it's a little bit weird but you choose whatever best for you your what resolution best for you to get much FPS in this game and you always want to set this display mode on full screen if you have on full screen window your FPS is gonna reduce by much and there will be a lot of FPS drop so you don't want it to full screen window or window make sure to have full screen and also my render resolution is set to medium since by adding it to high and it will reduce my fps by 10 and to native it will reduce by 15 or so so medium i still can't see enemy so i think it's fine I have above 50 now and if I have low I have uh, 60, 70, 65 so yeah but it's too blurry to see the enemy so I set the medium still can see enemy very clear I think it's fine as long as my PS is above 30 or 40 it's pretty much playable so yeah, you want to have height at least, so you have can to see enemy much better. But I already get used to the medium render, 
Exhalation too. It's fine for me, but if you don't, if your eyes can adjust to it, so yeah, maybe add it a little bit, like high or whatever, but for FPS, I gotta reduce it to medium. Yeah, I think that's all for me. So, I guess thanks for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoy this video and don't forget to leave a comment if you have any questions. And also if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe so I can make more content like this. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye bye. Hello everyone, so now in this video I'm gonna show you how to boost your for motherfucker shit <laughs>